Hi guys and welcome to another video. So in this video we're going to talk about uh, how to install Spacey on Windows, okay? If you are using Linux, the installation process is very easy, but if you are using Windows, uh, it could be very tricky, okay? So let's start uh, talking about what you need to do uh, to install this. So let's get, uh, get, um, get things done. Okay, let's click right here. Uh, you guys will need uh, Visual Studio uh, C++ B2s uh, 2014, okay? I'm going to show you guys how to, to install. Uh, so, it's very easy. Let's just click right over here. So, I'm going to click right here, okay? And it's very easy to do this. So, if you guys see right here, we have space is compatible with a 64 siphon. Uh, uh, there's the versions, so need to click Windows, uh, pip, uh, three, uh, let's, uh, you guys can see we have the command to install Spacey, so you guys need to type this command on the, um, prompt, uh, com prompt command, okay, uh, prompt command, so to do that, you could just, uh, copy this and, Clicking copy and paste and run, okay? Uh, but remember, you need to have the Visual Studio Build Tools installed in order to work. So, you guys need to install this. Let me see where it is. Uh, I'm going to drag over here. So, it's right here. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. So, so you guys need to install this program called Microsoft Visual C++ Build Tools. I have the version, uh, if I'm not mistaken, is the version uh, 2014. And you guys need to install this. I'm going to show you guys how to do that. Let me drag over here the, the program that you guys need to, to install. So right here we have uh, all the programs, some programs that I have. You also guys need to download this file. I'm going to open up. Uh, I think I'm gonna let uh, put a link in the description so you guys to download. If you guys uh, come over here on the stake overflow, you guys can see that we have a link for the 2015 version. So I'm gonna uh, use this version just as a demo. Okay, so let's uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to do this. So uh, the installation, as you guys can see, uh, was success successful. Okay, I have now a space. If I type Python here and I try to import Spacey, uh, if if and if if I don't see any errors, it means that we have successfully installed Spacey on this computer. So uh, let's just uh, wait till uh, until the 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 Visual Studio b gets launched, okay? So, if you guys have any problem regarding the installation of this program, you guys could definitely and should comment down below and I'll try to reach out for you guys to help you out, okay? So, let's wait. Uh, I'm gonna... So, you guys can see we have uh, successfully imported a Spacey. So I have a module right here. So I'm going to show you guys how this works. Just to show you guys how easy it is to use Spacey to do some natural language processing stuff. So uh, you guys can see that you... Okay, so we have the setup. Setup is initializing. So this is the setup is initializing, okay? You guys can see that we have some, it's verifying if I have, if I already have this installed on my computer. So it's gonna see that I already have uh, the Beauty Visual Studio, uh, the Microsoft Visual Studio C++ Beauty Tools installed on this computer. So it's not going to install uh, anything. Uh, but if you don't have, you guys should definitely install this. Uh, a lot of Python packages that use Siphon needs this in order to compile the source, okay? But if you guys uh, want to check out, you guys could definitely try to install the wheel file, which I'll come over here. 
let me see uh yeah i just open up another so if you guys type spacey right here you guys can see that this uh website hosts uh files uh will files for python so you will have a lot of files right here we have the compile files and it's it should work okay if you don't have if you don't want to install uh, the Microsoft Visual Studio, Video Visual Studio tools, you guys could try to install these files individually. So you guys need to download all of them. There, there is a lot of files. Is this Simon? Simon is a, is a, is a library to, uh, for locate memory to locate memory. So, I haven't look uh, at it uh in detail yet but i think it's a it's a very amazing stuff you can like um allocate memory as in c which is could be very useful so we have this murmur mur mur murmur hash which I, i'm not sure what it does we have the pre ha fresh hand i don't know how to say that i don't know is that correctly so we have a spacey right here we have the you guys can see it is 21.7 megabytes and we have thick as i actually think i think uh, okay so you guys need to this uh there are one two three four five libraries so if you guys install these five li five libraries you guys should definitely should be able to install spacey without a problem but if you do try and you guys um see errors you guys need to try to install with uh the microsoft you so guys can see uh if i try if i i already have installed so it shows me that i could uninstall okay if you if i didn't have this uh option wouldn't be available so uh thank you guys for watching this video i, I hope i could um uh solve your doubts ab around this and if you guys do have any uh, remaining doubts you guys should definitely try to comment down below and i'll try to reach uh, help you out okay so thanks for watching you guys and see you guys next time